Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Question four. 4.1, given the quadratic pattern 94, 90, 82, and 70, and then is an infinite, infinite, sure. mm. what do I, I feel, yeah, and then 4.1.1, Barry, we have to determine the next two terms of the number pattern. Sure. So, get out the difference. Common difference. Yeah. So term one minus term two. I have term four minus. We have term number one. We have term number two. We have term number three. We have term number four. Sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So term number term number four minus term number three. So I should say term number four, which is seven. Let me type it in my calculator. So I'm saying I should start from the end. You know? Yes. Okay. So I have seventy. Minus, no? Minus is 82. 82. Yeah, that's something that you should remember. We're talking about it now to say, which you should remember that if you are going backwards, we subtract. You know, it's term number two minus term number one. But if you are going forward, you add like term number one plus term number two. Yeah, you know, like if you want to get the difference. Yes. Yeah. So what did you get? Negative 12. So here you get minus 12. Okay. Yes. Sharp. And then term number three minus term number two. Okay. Negative what, eight. What one? Negative eight. So I'm saying this one, it's negative 12. This one, it's negative eight. Sure. Eight. Term number two minus term number one. Sure. It's negative four. So if we say this one, subtract this one, it gives us minus four. Yes. Okay. Sharp. Then uh, I uh, give the first difference. What what? Then center the 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 common one. So this is the, the first one. Yeah. Yes. Then uh, term number term number two of the first difference minus term number three of the first difference minus term number two. Okay, you want us to do something like this then? Let's go with this one. Subtract this one. So basically, on your yes. calculator now, you're going to have something that looks like this. You have minus 12, okay? Minus, minus 12, yes. open bracket, yes. minus 8. Yes. And then what do you get? Minus 4. Okay, so if you say this one, this one, subtract this one. Okay, what else? And then minus 8, minus 4. Minus into minus 4. It's minus 4. Minus 8 into minus open bracket, minus 4. Minus four, yes. It's minus four, like this. Yes. Sure. Yes. And then what do we do from and here? Then back to the question. Yeah. Um, the next two terms. Yeah. So let me see. Like a regular level and do it. Car ninety four minus four in pile ninety. Ninety minus eight. Yampa eighty two. 82 yeah. minus 12. Yampa barki. Yampa 70. So, gito nya ka the time city language first difference. Okay. So, gito so, bali minus 4. Go fast. Minus 4 here, ne? Yeah. Yeah. Then, kawale minus 16. Minus 16. Yeah. Then minus four go far, see? Minus four. And then go to minus 20. Minus 20. Okay, sharp. So min 70 plus minus 16. Yeah. 64. 70 so plus minus 60. Yes. And yeah. then 50, 54 plus minus 20 is 34. It's 34. So your next two terms, yes. you are saying it's 54. And 34. And 34, like this. Okay, one, two. Yes. So, and then another way, just as, as, as a hint, you, know, you could also have done it this way. You could have said, okay, but remember, if I say this one plus this one plus this one, if I just take this zigzag like this, you know, this one plus this one plus this yes. one, they give me 70. You know? 
And yes. then I take this one plus this one plus this one, then I expect them to give me this one. And then this one plus this one plus this one. I expect them to give me this one. So that's another way in which you could have made your life a little bit simple. Okay, so we're done with 4.1.1. Let's go to 4.1.2. So it says determine term TN, the general term of the number party. Okay, so we go to 4.1.2. Yeah, what should we do from here? Um. Mm. First thing, it already two a is equaling to the second term of the the second difference. The first term of the second difference, which so is two negative a, four. Two a is going to be equal to the second difference. Two a is equal to mm -hmm. the second diff. Is mm -hmm. equal to the second difference. Yeah. Yes. Sure. And then to get to get a, you to divide like a two. Both divide, sides. By divide by two and then what do you get as your a a is negative two sharp okay we get one mark for this by the way it's worth noting which you get one mark for that okay what else are you going to do here so tn is equal to 3a multi plus b 3a is 3a plus b plus b is close to the first term of the first difference so we can call it F1 just to make it clear. Is the first term of the first yeah. difference. We are talking about which term is yeah. this one? Yes, negative four. Negative four. So in other words, you're saying three. We know what is A. What is A? It's negative two. Okay, we know A as negative two, close bracket. Okay, yes. plus a B, That's which B. is going to be. We are saying we know what is this. Okay? Yeah. Term of the first difference yeah. is. Negative four. Negative four. Okay. How should I proceed yes. from here? And then three multiply by negative two, it will give you negative six. And minus then six plus b plus is equal b. to minus four. Sure. Minus four. Yeah. Yes. And then to get the glory b is equal to b transpose the negative. It becomes positive this side. Yes. Okay, what do we get? B is equal to positive two. B is going to be positive two. Oh, you get another mark for this one. Okay. Yes. What else? And then to get C, you'll say T1, the first term. T1. Is equal to A plus B plus C. Is going to be equal to A. Plus B. Plus B plus C. Ne? Yes. What is term number one? What is the first term? It's 94. It's 94. Okay. You come and say we have 94. Ne? What is A? Yes. It's negative two. Negative two plus. What is our B? It's positive two. Okay. This one and this one, they cancel each other out. Eh? Yes. And then what is our C? It's 94. 24. You get another mark here. Okay, therefore, what is Tn? Therefore, uh, negative 2n squared. You have minus 2n squared, sure. Plus 2n. Plus 2n. Plus 94. Plus 94. And then you get your fourth mark here. So if you can do this Thursday, ah, you should be fine. You should okay. be fine. Okay, um, we have this one of consecutive terms. We have yes. this one of consecutive terms. And then, um, how should we approach this one? 4.1.3. Like, let's say you're advising so, someone who's going to be writing. What is it that they should concentrate on here if they're looking for consecutive terms? Um, firstly, oh, oh, you can find out like there as if like the quadratic pattern I think. Okay, so you are proposing which they can remove this part, I okay? guess. Yes. Sure. And then unyake the general term of the linear pattern. So let's write it. Now we're doing 4.1.3. So on 4.1.3, from what I'm hearing, you are saying learners should first write the first difference and the second difference. Forget about the quadratic. Let's do that. So we have minus four. Yes. Okay? 
We have minus eight. We have minus twelve. We have minus sixteen. And then this one and this one we have minus four. Okay. Minus four. And minus four. And then you are saying because you saw this word consecutive, okay? Two consecutive terms. So and then let's go through it. <laughs> Find the, the general thing for the limb that Tn is equals to Bn. Is Tn is equal to? Bn plus C. Tn is going to be equal to Bn plus C. We can use this one. We can also use this one. There's this one Rene Ube used. You still remember this one? So we can also use that yes. one if to Mara. It's up to you which one you prefer. Okay, so yes. you use this one, yeah? And then... Uh, our um, our B is our constant. The, yeah, our first common. Yes, it's negative yeah. four. Negative four, n. And then yes. Yeah. Plus C, and then kilo chat term number one. Yeah. What is term number one? Um, are you still here? He left. Um, okay, um.